The End of a Crisis by Cindy Juyong Ok When you leap over the deer carcasses that line every garden, you will marvel at their tidiness, at how bloodless a death by drought can be. When I crawl through the highway pieces, shattered by heat, I will admire the clean slits as I kick aside crumbles of broken stone with little blistering. When you thread between the overtaken shores and bodies of elders frozen, when I follow the fallen saplings' directions toward the horizon where colourless sky and earth meet, we will remember rippling at the birthday parties for corporations and framing the ash of beloved photos burnt in wildfire. When we think of crossing the river to each other, you from the gorge of the landslide to me at the crest of the typhoon, it is then we will find ourselves in a dead imaginary in some fictive past where the you exists, where I is not a myth we use to keep surviving at the cost of bird and glacier, home and tenderness. Having ruined the future of becoming fossils, finally we will know that it is for nothing we die. Never in place of drowned sea turtles, or swarming locusts, or to foil cancerous sand and mould. Not even for the dance of subway floods, or the graceless eclipse of all our promises and planets.